Hello Dats Nuts and welcome to Dats Review Channel. In this video I'm going to be looking at the Unicorn Yellow Classen World Champion Phase 2 darts. So let's check them out. So the darts come very nicely packaged and this is the deluxe packaging which the started last year I believe and if you noticed on the back it's got the L-Style badge as well because Yellow Classen uses L-Style flights. So it's got this cardboard sleeve which you take that off and then you've got another very neat cardboard box, very thick dense cardboard, very tough. and open that up and on the left hand side you've got all the details about the darts and on the right you've got the info about the player in the middle obviously the darts underneath this little foam covering and the darts are fitted into a foam insert and are supplied with a, a, a unicorn point protector and underneath that you've got some of the gripper 4 element stems and you've got the L style carbon 260 stems you got two sets of the standard shape yellow class and ultra fly f flights they're the big wing and you've got the small standard ultra fly and the darts themselves are already fitted with the L style uh, 370 shafts uh, quite a slim flexible shaft and they also come with the limited, limited edition yellow class and L style flights. Very nice uh, picture on them. Uh, these might be the easy flights because it's got the built in champagne ring. But it doesn't say whether it's them. Um, but I think that's what it is. So very beautifully packaged and great looking barrels. So the darts fit with a black coated point and as is often the case with yellow class and darts they're often quite an unusual shape this is probably a little bit more uniform than some of the darts he's had it's got a tapered front and then just before you get to the middle you've got this indented section and then it's kind of almost straight and then a, another slight taper towards the end but uh, very nice looking dart and as you can see it's got quite an unusual grip style etched into it on the front you've got these three grooves and the little circular type indents so a little bit of grip there so probably around about medium level there and this kind of pattern I'm not even sure what it is look like arrow heads or something who knows what you call it but it looks nice so that scallop section with the rings on and the pattern either side gives quite a nice feel to that so I'm guessing maybe that's where yellow class and grips it but um, probably medium to almost high medium and then as you get to the rear it's kind of a mixture of the smooth sections and a little bit more of that weird style grip but very nice looking barrel and there's the L style shafts quite flexible ones and these are the good looking uh, L style flights That's fit with a black coated 28mm point. There's a tapered front to the barrel. It's a mix of thin grooves and circular dots. That's 8.8mm. And then you've got this weird style grip which looks like arrow heads. That's 9.9mm. And then you've got a scallop section with thin rings and grooves. That's 4mm. And you've got more of that arrow head style grip with 
thin grooves that's 9.3 millimeters and then another section of that of 8.5 millimeters and then a smooth section on the end of 5.2 millimeters length is 45.78 millimeters width is 7 millimeters that's 21.95 grams Uh, 22.02 grams and 22.03 grams and the full setup is 23.55 grams with nothing attached the balance is just a little front of the center and with the supplied setup it moves a little bit towards the rear and this is the balance with medium in between short nylon stems and standard flights overall the grip is low medium to around about medium so I'd probably say about 5.5 overall weird shape to his barrels that I don't always know how to grip or throw them but these ones are a little bit more of a conventional style and not too weird like some of the ones he's had in the past so they actually fly uh, quite nice they feel quite effortless to throw the grip at the front is um, again on that thin tape which I'm not always keen on but it's not overly grippy, it's probably closer to a, a lowish medium but uh, I do feel a little bit from them kind of weird shaped uh, cuts and just a little bit of grip from the rings there but I think that scallop section there is probably where it's going to be the most grip um, but it's not quite in the middle so I'm just going to try just a little bit above that so I'm a little bit on it but obviously that is put there to suit yellow classing so <laughs> I know what's happening there <laughs> I think the way I'm gripping it there it's kind of like pushing the dart up a little bit but if you want to grip it right right in that scallop and it uh, suits you then great because it's fairly comfortable gripping it there but I think I'm always trying it from the middle and the rear so I'm just trying it slightly above it but uh, it's flying quite nice from there flying uh, a lot smoother so if, if like I say you are kind of a similar grip position to Yellow Classen. You're probably going to get on with the darts quite well. But for other people, it's kind of experimental. As I say, he does have a slightly unique style of throwing, but it's a lovely looking dart. Um, it does feel nice when you, in your fingers. It's not overly grippy though. I'd say that section is probably just around medium level so I'm going to try the rear section now but again I'm mostly on a smooth path I'm not sure if I like these uh, thin stems as well but <laughs> these stems and flight is something that you can easily change to suit yourself Usually, when I've done the video review, I often play with the darts quite a bit longer just to get a better feel of them and then I usually write on my written review what I think and I think I'm going to be playing with these a little bit longer but I'm probably going to try gripping it around that scallop just to see because it seemed to be flying the best from there I do like the look 
of these. Let's check out the ratings. It's a nice looking dart, so I'm going to give it 8.5. And as said before, the grip is low, medium to around about medium, so 5.5 for that. Weight match, two barrels were very close, one was a little bit off, so 8 for that. Quality overall is very nice, but there is some machine bears on the arrowhead style grip, so 8 for that. And it is quite an expensive dart, but it is nicely packaged and it comes with some nice extras, so 6 for value. So there you go, that's the Unicorn Yellow Classen World Championship Phase 2 dart. Um, probably not quite right for me with my normal front grip, but it was flying quite well from there. So probably going to suit people that maybe just slightly front of centre or spot on the centre. But like I said, I'm going to try with them a little bit longer because it might be just one of them darts that I need to play about with the setup a little bit and just get used to the feel because it does feel quite nice in the fingers and it overall it's flying quite nice through the air but uh, I do think it looks a great dart and it's not as uh, strange as some of the darts that Yellow Claston's had in the past but um, obviously it's quite an expensive package but there you go. So that's the end of the review. Stick around for the gallery at the end of this and make sure you subscribe to the channel. Happy darting.